In this video, we will see how to clone any website for free. We will download the source code of the website, including all the HTML files, CSS files, and the JavaScript files. And we will also download all the assets, including the images and the vector images. This is the website that we will be using for this example. Let us see how to download the source code of this website. If you want to visit this website, just go to the internetq.tech. To download the source code of this website, just go to uh, Google and type save all resources. Click on this first result. So this is the extension that we will be using to download the source code of the website. You can scroll down to see all the information. After you read the information, click on this get button. And click on add extension. So it starts downloading the extension for you. Just give you a few seconds, it will download the extension and enable it in your Microsoft Edge or Google Chrome. Now our extension has been installed successfully. You can see that now it says remove. So let's come to our website and click on refresh. So let me minimize this pop-up and right click on the website and click on inspect. A new pop-up will be opened on the right side. As you can see, this is how the inspect will look like. In the top left uh, right hand side, you can see a plus icon and click on resource saver. So, so this is the resource saver extension. You can select all the files that you want to download. So select beautify JavaScript HTML CSS before download. And if you want to select uh, any other feature, you can select that. That is download from all domains. So just leave all as a default and click on save all resources. It starts the uh, compress the and you click on save all resources, you can see that it starts compress all the files from the website. So just give you a few seconds, after you fetch all the files, it will compile them as a zip file and it starts downloading the browser itself. As you can see, the download starts. So let me save, uh, save this file. Let's save the file in the desktop. Now the download has been finished successfully. So let's extract this file. Right click on that file and click on extract files. Select the location you want to extract. In this case, let's select documents. Inside the document, let's make a new folder now. So the folder name will be Internet Q. So click OK. As you can see, the extract has been successfully done. Let's open the documents folder now and find the Internet Q folder. This is the folder that we have extracted. So let's open that and open internetq.tech inside this folder you will find all the files as you can see we have the index file if you open that file you can see that now we got the website for offline viewing as you can see the website has been worked uh, properly you can scroll down to see if you want to edit this file you can open this in notepad or visual studio code to edit this so let's open this file in notepad and try to change something. As you can see, we got all the source code from that website. So let's try to change something in here. For example, let's change the title of this website. Let me change this to uh, programming tutorial. Let me clear this and type programming tutorial. Let's save this and close now. If you refresh the uh, page now, you can see that the title has been changed from Internet Key to Programming Tutorial. If you want to see all other files like the style files and JavaScript files, you can see that we have the CSS. If you open that now, you get the style.css. If you open the image folder, you can see all the images from that website. For example, if you open the footer website, footer image, so this is the world image from that website. So if you open the hero image. As you can see this actually from the internet.tech. So let's close this. Let's come back and open this JavaScript file now. If you open the file in Notepad, you can see the JavaScript of the website. So this is for tutorial purpose only. Don't use this for maliciously. This uh, video is only to teach you how you can get here. Right? This only this video is only teach you what are the possible ways of how you can download the entire source code of the website. 
don't use it for any illegal activities. This is for this video and I will meet you in the next one.